KZ breaking news. Good evening, I'm Max McGee. And I'm Ava Joy Burnett. We are following breaking news tonight at the Inner Harbor where multiple people are under arrest following a massive disturbance. WJZ is live. Pat Warren has more on the developing situation. Pat. Well, we have not been able to confirm the exact amount of juveniles who were here at the harbor, but one observer estimates about 100. There were several groups of them. They were rowdy, some fights broke out, and police were called in. There was heavy police presence when we arrived here, and they quickly worked to disperse the crowds and move everybody out. At one point, it appeared that they had even closed off parts of the harbor from access to the uh, buildings inside. Now, we have no reports of injuries, but other people who were watching said it appeared that some of those fights were serious, and others said they didn't realize anything was going on at all. First, I thought somebody was shooting or something was happening because it was such a large rush of people coming through. There was no adults with them, just children of all ages running amok, and then they would just start hitting people. They would try to split in different directions to get away from the cops, and it was just a Massive rush of kids. I'm from Baltimore. I come down here a lot. I think it's pretty safe. I just, I just so happened to be passing through. I didn't know anything was going on, to be honest with you. I thought it was like a parade or something, you know. Yeah, like I feel safe anywhere I go to. Baltimore is a, is a beautiful place. Again, it was a very heavy police presence. They performed their job quickly. They got everything calmed down. Most of the officers have left the vicinity right now, and things appear to be getting back to normal. I'm Pat Warren reporting live for WJZ.